guys, it's Tiny Tom Logan back with another video for you. Uh, my neighbours are just outside the window, so I think they're going to think I'm mental, but maybe that's because I am. Now, anyway, so we've already taken a look at the X99 Deluxe, and like I said, it's probably one of the prettiest boards that I've seen so far, and I, I have seen pictures from pretty much every manufacturer, and this is the one that's really stuck in my teeth. But what I did do recently when I was um, away in London to have a look at all the X99 boards was I did see some bare PCB ones and I might have just possibly, maybe, removed one. So this is essentially um, a completely naked PCB for the X99 Deluxe. Now essentially what's happened is they've taken this off of the production line before they've put anything on there. It is just the, the silicon and the copper trails and everything. Now I find this type of stuff personally quite fascinating because I just love to see the intricateness of these before they get all the um, uh, components and then obviously the, the matte black film to get rid of all that copper and everything. So I thought you lot would like to have a look at it as well and it quite literally is just going to be a look around it. We can have a look at this bit, you know I mean we can have a look at it, uh, we'll look at it the other way around also, you get to see the, uh, the naked Asus overclock socket with all the extra pins in it as well. But don't forget, if you want to um, have a look at this in detail, uh, then you can just pause and what you can do it that way. What we'll do is we'll, we'll zoom in just so that you get a better look. I'm going to try and keep the light from reflecting on it as much as I possibly can. And then obviously up this area is your, your I.O. area. These will be like little MOSFETs down here. This is quite close to the RAM and you've got the cover that goes over this so you won't see it. If we go around this way, you've got the MOSFETs and the chokes and the caps and everything for the top. This is your 8-pin cable. This is your fan connectors up here. Obviously, we've got the, the DRAM down both sides. This is where the X99 chipset sits. You have all your SATA memory down here. These are where your switches go. USB 3. I personally think, you know, like I said, it's, it's almost like a nerdy work of art. I personally want to stick this in a frame and put it up in the office. I have put a request in to try and get a naked rampage. I don't know whether I'm going to get one. Asus actually don't want to let me keep this. They're that kind of like funny about it. But then we've got round the back of the board again. You wouldn't normally get to see this much copper. It would normally be coated and everything as well. But like I said, I just find it personally fascinating to the point where I thought I would share my nerdy joy with you guys. So there we go. You've seen something that not many people ever really get to see, but I'd like I said, I'd properly like this. I'd love to turn it into a clock or something to go on the wall in the office, or like I said, just in a nice frame. Maybe I should just not send it back and put it up in the office. I think they think I'm going to like send it to um, their competitors or something. Oh, I, mean, I think they're stupid. I want to keep it. But anyway, if we put it down. We'll zoom us out a little bit because I did zoom us in. Put it down. You can see the two side by side, although not very centralised. Because I'm a bit of a moron. But yeah, you can see the two side by side. And I personally, like I said, this pleases my inner nerd greatly. But for now, at least, this is Tiny Tom Logan with a naked x99 deluxe and it's a little bit more than taking the heat sinks off I mean, we've taken everything off so with the asus x99 deluxe fully exposed this is tiny tom logan with another video for you out 